Ganga Hill in Busoga for an update on the ongoing celebrations to match the seventh coronation of the Chabazing of Busoga, William Gabola Nadiope IV. Samuel Sebeleva behind me is ready to give us an update. A very good afternoon, my brother. What's the latest coming in from Busoga? To you, uh, Romeo Busiku and NTV viewers, right now, we are coming to you live from Bugembe, uh, the official palace of Chavazinga, of, of Busoga, the current Chavazinga, William Uliba Fossi, Gabla Nadiop. It is the coronation day. It is now the seventh coronation day. Uh, we are celebrating today. Well, you, if you all remember, he was installed as the current and the legitimate king of, Chavaz of Busoga and the full Chavazinga of Busoga on 13th September uh, 2014, which is today. So we are here to remember his coronation. And here with me, uh, if you can look around, if uh, to, to just give you a brief background, uh, the, 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 the function started early this morning, and many people are here, including the speaker, of, uh, the, the former speaker of parliament, Rebecca Itwala Kadaga, and many other dignitaries. Here with me is the uh, minister for legal affairs of, uh, of Busoga, Council Alex Ruganda to give us just a simple background of this function, the underlying importance of this function as per the Chavazin of, of Busoga. Thank you very much and thank you to NTV. Uh, today, which is the 13th of September, we are marking seven years since the current Chavazinga of Busoga was installed as the legitimate Chavazinga of Oba Chavazinga of Busoga, which is a cultural institution. Uh, for purposes of the day, it is a day when we remember the achievements that the new leadership at Bugembe has gone through over the last seven years. Important to note is that the constitutional role of a cultural institution right now under the Constitution of Uganda and the Traditional Leaders Act is to create unity amongst the people that they lead. So over the last seven years, you see that more of Asoga are getting united, which is good for even national development. Uh, the role of the cultural institution is to instill culture amongst the people. And that has been properly done by the leadership over the last seven years. And I see that over time, you see so many people right now donning t-shirts. I'm proud to be a msoga, ndimusoga, chikurume, and so many other rhetorics, which means that so many people are raising up to get back to their cradle and get their identity. Culture is very important in the development of a nation and in the discipline of a nation. But also important to note is that uh, the, the kingdom, through programs and partnerships, has offered over 6,000 scholarships, academic scholarships, right from primary school to secondary and to other levels. So it is very, very, very important for the people of Busoga. We have health programs and so many other things that the Kingdom will be, the Kingdom Prime Minister will be talking about today because uh, within a few minutes from now he will be addressing the nation and I know NTV will capture everything. Mm. That would be uh, um, uh, uh, Council, there was lapses, there was a gap between 2014, 2018 to 2014. 2008 yeah. 2014. Yes, how yes. did it affect uh, the, uh, the, the, the watch I was in? No, inevitably we had had a challenge of transition. The, f the former Chavazingo of Busoga passed on, His uh, Highness Muloki passed on in 2008. So between 2008 to 23rd August 2014, we had a leadership crisis because they were different groups. Uh, initially in Busoga, the royal families among the five that came from Bunyoro and the, the key royal families in Busoga produced the Chavazinga. So ordinarily, if the one royal house has produced the Chavazinga, the next one is from one of the other four. So the challenge we had is that there was a disagreement as to that rotational basis. But that was solved, lucky enough, and right now we have all the chiefdoms moving together, including Vulamoj. And if you realize, last year, the chief of Vulamoj Moji, who is the Oteite Zibondo, visited his brother, the current Chabazinga, in Budumbula Palace, in Kamuli. So that shows you that right now, Busoga, all the 11 chiefdoms are moving in.